Good to see you. Let's get to work. The Malon once used this system as a dump site. However, the radiation levels have been dropping. We investigated and found that the Vaudoir had chased the Malon away. Our intelligence indicates the Vaudoir are expecting us to deploy surveillance beacons into the area. Which is why we have done just that. We've learned they plan to ambush us when we retrieve the data from the beacons. When that happens, they'll go from hunter to prey. The beacons are now, in essence, Vaudoir bait. We will counterattack the Vaudoir, disable one of their ships, and recover the intel data from their systems. We will then analyze the data to determine their recent movements and objectives. We want to locate one of their main bases. So far, we've had little luck in finding where they hole up when they're not on the attack. This should change that. Time's a factor here. Let's get to work and scan the beacons. We wouldn't want to disappoint the Vaudoir, now would we? So welcome to Gone Dark Patrol Mission on Star Trek Online. Thank you so much for joining me. My name's Mac from LOA. So let's get into it. So we're setting a trap for the Vardvar. Yeah, uh, those Romulans, the sneaky little buggers, aren't they? Right, okay. Coming here was foolish. Here they come. The fate of all fools. Right, so these fell for the first trap. Uh, I'm back in my T6 tactical escort. Uh, the Valiant class. Uh, this is the USS Fire Drake. I bloody love this ship. Uh, they're quite tough, the uh, Vardvar. Uh, they've kicked my ass quite a few times. So it'll be good to get my own back. I've got the Romulans backing me up as well, which is good. The ship is disabled. Time to acquire their data. Right, let's get that data. We have the data. Warning. And come under attack. And come. Alright, oh, here come more of them. So the Vardvar use these weird tractor beams. Uh, they're quite nice, really. But they're a bit deadly. So it looks like the trap's working. Hopefully we'll get the data to find out where their base is. You most probably know by now, but um, if you don't, I've got the assimilated Borg deflector engines and shield, and I've got the Iconium warp core. Uh, yeah, it's a tough little ship. It's taken me a while to get it up to the up to snuff but uh yeah really pleased with it the legendary vaudoir paranoia we should expect heightened resistance as we move forward initial analysis of the data we acquired from them isn't turning up much i'm afraid we caught a small fish this time let's continue shall we i look forward to seeing what swims up to nibble at our bait next time she's a little tease isn't she very unlike Romulans. Right, we'll go to the next marker. Get the next beacon. Gonna come again, aren't You're they? Not leaving here alive. Here he comes. He didn't last very long. I've got a, a destabilizing beam. There we go. I'll put that on him. Destabilize him. Uh, so I've got the plasma torpedo from the Borg uh, Omega Force reputation set. Uh, yeah, it's a good torpedo there. Right, so I've got to download the data again. The successful day at the pond. 
Let's see what secrets our latest catch has to share with She's us. She's obsessed with bloody fishing. Ah, our fish has swum through many waters indeed. I think we have something here. The ship's been to a couple of systems often. One system comes up more than the other. That's probably where their base is. Yeah, right. But we need to be sure. I'm afraid we need to do some more fishing. Okay, so I'll head over there to the uh, new marker. So it looks like they've got an idea with the bases. But uh, she just wants to make sure. I'll right, we'll scan that. There they come again. Yeah, I highly recommend that you borg a sim simulated space set. It's really good. Um, you really get some good shields from it. Right, did I hear a new cloak ship coming? Right, recover the data from that ship. Destroy them! Open fire! All weapons! Uh, a lot of the weapons on my um, T6 Tactical Escort are from the missions Sunrise, um, which is on the Future Proof Story Arc, and they are free. Uh, I highly recommend getting them if you're doing a phaser build. Right, so that's the first uh, incoming Vibar group. This is the second. Jesus. Heavy artillery vessel. Try and take that out if we can. That's the only thing when you're in a little ship, your shields can get um, dropped quite quickly. Right, we're nearly there, we got him down. Big ship, that one. Alright, we'll get the stragglers. That's it. That was just one over there. Beauty. Hmm. It appears the Vardwar aren't amused by our angling efforts. We may be wearing out our welcome here. I'm afraid not. This vessel was assigned a patrol in another sector and came in response to a distress beacon from earlier. It hasn't been to either of the systems we're looking at as a potential base location. It's risky, but I'm willing to cast my line one more time. Will you join me? Yeah, why not? Let's just bloody do it. Always a bigger fish. I'm right, scanning. There's no time for formalities. A large Vodwar strike force is en route to this position at High Warp. I doubt they're coming to exchange pleasantries. I like this uh, Romulan uh, Sheila. I think she's a bit of a looker. Expecting. We'll continue this conversation soon. For the moment, I suggest you prepare for the fight of your life. Right. Your time has passed. So a big fleet's coming in. Jesus, there is a few of them as well. Right, let's head over that way. Send them packing. Right, so they got me in a tractor beam. I think they're mainly cruisers. But, uh, there could be one of those heavy artillery uh, ships as well. Keep an eye out for that. Yeah, as well as the plasma torpedoes at the front, I've got quantum torpedoes, uh, which come as the quantum phase set. 
Uh, so I highly recommend, yeah, have a little look at the Sunrise mission and the Stormbound mission in the Future Proof story arc. Uh, yeah, really good weapons, and uh, like I say, they're all free. Alright, so we're not doing too bad at the minute. Get rid of this assault vessel. Yeah, stick that up your hooter. Right, Jesus, that's it. Right, so that's one of those big heavy artillery vessels. But, uh, yeah, it's, it's nearly gone. Jesus, we're taking a bit of punishment here. That was in the tractor beam. Be okay. Only a few Vodwa remain. Nearly there. Yeah, I really like that uh, Romulan uh, lady. Got the it. I think we've uh, finished the bad bar off. Now then, let's discuss what's going on here. Judging by the company you're keeping, I guess it involves some unorthodox operations. What mischief has Sub Commander Sahen dragged you into, and how can I extract you from it? Oh. Ah, Commander Jarak. So glad you could join our little fishing trip today. Our mischief is an operation aimed at discovering the location of a hidden Vodwar base. We were hoping to glean that data from one of the Vodwar ships we lured here. But, as you can see, they were quite indisposed. Permanently so, in point of fact. Yeah. I see. Vodwar activity in this region is a growing concern. Finding this base is a worthy objective. How can I be of assistance? Very well. We'll set course for the first location on your list. Yeah, good hunting. Don't mind Commander Jarak. She and I have a personal disagreement from another lifetime. Not the cleanest ending to this operation, but Jarak can see what the Vodwar are up to in one system, while I take a look at the other. Yes. Well, between us, I hope she finds nothing but an old toothless Vodwar merchant selling fat tribbles and fake Tranya. <laughs> right. I'll take all the luck I can get. Comes in handy in my line of work. Thanks again for your help. Perhaps you and I can go fishing again sometime. Is she flirting Until with me? Until then, may the elements watch over you. Yeah. Right, okay. So that was the Gondark patrol mission in the new last system. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for joining me. Um, if you did like the video and you would consider subscribing, that'd be absolutely bonza. But uh, until next time, Earthlings, stay safe and take it easy.